Greetings, friends and foes. It's your boy, Brian Polito, and here we are, November 30th, 2018. And holy mackerel, it's my birthday. How did all this happen? It's crazy. I figured I would kind of come to you guys and say hello, check in, give you some updates, and ruminate a little on this day, my birthday, the, my 57th year on this earth. It's crazy. For all you young people out there, you'll look and you'll say, ah, look at that old man. If you're lucky, you'll last that long. It's crazy, man. You blink your eye and then boom, you're here. Well, this is what, my 26th year professionally in comic books and uh, we're having probably more fun now than we've had ever. What, let me think here. What was I gonna ruminate about? Well, thank you so much to everybody on Facebook for all your birthday wishes. I was doing my best to hit like on all of them and then it got overwhelming. I particularly liked the post that the guys did over in Collector's Corner where they pasted my face on Lady Death's body. So uh, I thought that was great. Um, I guess I'm ruminating over here. Uh, life is really great. Uh, it's, the, you know what I don't like? I mean, I guess for my birthday, what I request you guys and girls do out there is go out there and have a blast this weekend. Go watch an obscure horror film. Have a drink of your choice. In fact, I mean, right now I'm going to have a little shot of Fireball. Um, for Fireball haters out there, you can hate it. I like it. Don't worry about it. Happy birthday oh. to you. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Brian. Walking in like the zombie horse. Happy birthday to you. Okay, I'm going to make a wish. Ooh. Are you guys with me? Get ready. Here we go on three. One, two. two. Oh, I don't want to spit on this thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, just spit on it. Just blow spit it. on Isn't it. That's the thought you get when you know. No, don't <laughs> spit, honey. Just I got to do air only, right? Only air. Okay, I'm going to try, try it. No spit. No, no spit. spitting. You can do it. I think that was a little spit. <laughs> Yeah, it's crazy, day. man, getting to this age, but I feel good. Uh, my back was, was so a little sore this morning. <laughs> <laughs> Just to remind me, I have a birthday. I was like, oh, we should play with my dogs. Uh oh. Hey, man. But anyway, uh, thanks. Uh, actually, we have the coffin crew here. It's great. Uh, so, some announcements. Um, uh, Brandy Reese, would you like to announce that we are. <laughs> You're Brandy. Come over here, Brandy. <laughs> would you like to announce that uh, Lady Death. Uh, Nightmare, Nightmare Symphony, Symphony Kickstarter, Kickstarter is officially gone. Shipped out. Y'all have it. Correspondence If you haven't received your tracking numbers by Monday, please get in touch with our customer service department, Nick G at inquiries at coffincomics.com, and we'll reserve, uh, we'll resolve any matters you have. And if for some crazy reason you haven't filled out your survey, yes. Nick, how many surveys do we have not filled out still? About so we have about 80 people, 80 lunatics, who backed our Kickstarter, but they haven't <laughs> filled out their survey. So we encourage you to check your email or get in touch with us, reconnect, so we can get you your stuff, especially before the holidays, right? Right. Anything you want to say about delivering this campaign? It was bananas, right? We love you. It was so crazy. It was insane. <laughs> but? But thank you, and we love you. All right, great. All right, you're out. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. Right. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> I don't know how it happened that Brandy Reese, whose favorite band is New Kids on the Block. Stone Temple uh, Pilots. Okay, better. Stone Temple Pilots. <laughs> better. Oh, oh, oh. I do have concert tickets to the New Kids on the Block, though. And There's... you say that like it's a good thing. It is a good thing. <laughs> I don't know. Don't to feel young again. It's to feel young. Okay. There you go. Well... Yeah, she's the white sheep of the family, uh, strangely. But uh, so let's see, what else? Uh, what's coming up? Here we are, racing into December, and I want to let you know that we're actually going to show you some of the stretch goals and comics we already have in for Hell Witch. So amazingly, here is the holo foil card designed by Mr. Bernie Fritz over here, newlyweds. The lovely Lindsay yeah. and Bernie, newlyweds. Aww. Here's the wooden nickel that came out phenomenally. I gotta tell you. Here we have uh, Hell Witch and the Hellborn did a takeover on this uh, Quaffin Comics logo. Excuse me. And then, of course, for those of you, I. Excuse me. <laughs> 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 I'm 
I dare you guys to put this bumper sticker on the back of your car. Go to hell. <laughs> Here's our cool 5x5 five five campaign sticker. Oh, Another go to hell. And believe it or not, we already have in-house the uh, soft enamel pin. Uh, Bernie and I have really kind of figured out a way to get these done more efficiently, and they're already in, so they're cool. In fact, I think, Nick, we're going to offer them on backer kit, right? Yeah. yeah. So, by the way, speaking of backer kit, we're already going to launch the backer kit for Hell Witch Hellborn Kickstarter. We're going to do a smoke test on Monday, which means that we're going to send out uh, surveys to about 5% of the people. We're going to test and debug all the software, make sure everything's smooth, and then on Tuesday, officially, we're going to blast it out to the rest of the backers. Now, I'm going to let you know. We're going to back this up with some uh, marketing, but we're going to have a shorter uh, time for the actual backer kit survey period. It's going to be shorter than normal. That's because the holidays are coming up, and so we're going to encourage and ask everybody, get your surveys in really quick so that we can start shipping your stuff. Let's see. Oh, and we got, now we're starting to get in all the printed matter. So here is a, a Hell Witch Slabbed Edition. And for those of you who don't know, although this is 100% paper and it has a grade of 13, this is a completely real live slab book. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> this is only made out of paper, so for, but, but we do a pretty good job of doing a facsimile. Dan Feldmeyer did the graphic design on this, and this is from the Coffin Comics Guarantee. So once again, this is a completely real slabbed book. No, it isn't. Uh, that's part of the mystery envelope. And then here's one of the cool whoops, <laughs> mid-campaign mid uh, books by, covered by Richard Ortiz. Really fun. So let's see. Any, anybody have anything else they need to say? Folks, say hello to Mr. Nick G. Hey! It's your customer service manager, Mr. Nick G in the house. How you doing? Look at you, man. You're looking bright-eyed and bushy-tailed on a Friday. Yeah. <laughs> He's ready for the weekend. Resident ass kicker Jeff K back here. The aforementioned. What's up? Uh, what's up? And then the lovely Francisca Polito, Dakota Reese, our warehouse assistant. Uh, one of Dakota's many, many skills is that I think all you guys and gals who are comic book fans can understand that comic books have unusual <laughs> naming conventions like how they're named and just the billions of different names and Dakota's a whiz. She's right up there with Nick or myself at remembering all these freaky names. Wouldn't you guys agree? Oh yeah. I would agree. Most definitely. Agree. Right agree. Well folks, um, this is my crazy rambling uh, birthday address. I am 57. It feels pretty good. It's kind of boggling my own mind. I could tell you I definitely feel like I'm 25 inside. Except this morning. I could tell you, except for this morning with my back. But I can tell you that all my likes and interests kind of like came together by the time I was 12 years old and I like the same stuff still. You know, for this weekend, for my birthday, what I request of Fiend Nation is go out there and watch an obscure horror film, something weird. You know, go look at some foreign language one. And then also, uh, if you're out there and you're a couple, whatever, however you're coupled, you're married, you're dating, you're a couple, you're kind of getting together, I want you guys to get a little jazzy. And when you do, <laughs> think of me. <laughs> this is how y'all know he's off his rocker. <laughs> <laughs> that was so good. That was uncalled for. I'm sorry that was uncalled for, but uh, I, all I'm saying is <laughs> just remember that we're we're there to just encourage you to have fun. <laughs> hey, you guys have been great. I've been Brian Polito. Thank you for attending my birthday address. Holler at your boy. Talk to you soon. Woohoo! Woo